Last week, it was a feeling of uncertainty. This week, a reason to celebrate. All the players love each other on this team, and I, that really became evident to me this week. And all the coaches love the players, and I kind of took all that in this week as I was going through a lot of things in my mind. And, um, you know, North Dakota State's a really special place. Defensive coordinator Chris Kleiman will replace Craig Bull and become the new head coach of the Bison following the season. I mean, ever since he's been here, you can just see what it's done for the program uh, from the defense. From I mean, we were a, a, a good defense w when he got here, but he's made us into a, a great defense. However, this week, there is even less time to reflect. Finals going on throughout campus and shortened preparation time with the game being played on Friday night. Because you want to be fresh at kickoff. You want your guys knowing what they're doing, uh, but uh, to, to say that, okay, it's just one less day and we're going to do the exact same thing in practice uh, all the way through, I think that's somewhat short-sighted. New Hampshire under 15th year head coach Sean McDonald is making its 10th consecutive playoff appearance the longest streak in the nation. Some teams we've played, quite frankly, in the past, it's somewhat scatterbrained, it's grab bag. You'll see this on defense or that on offense. These guys, there's a plan on everything they do. To be honest, I think they're kind of like us in this mindset of they come out, they play hard, and they just try to get the job done. Offensively, the Wildcats are outscoring their opponents by more than 10 points per game. Led by wide receiver duo RJ Harris and Justin Mello, who have combined for close to 2,000 yards, 150 receptions, and 15 touchdowns. And they pass it to whoever they want to pass it to, but then they also run the ball as well with the running back, and then the quarterback ran for a few yards last week. So it's a very balanced team, a very balanced group of guys, and it's going to be a, a, a good one on Friday. This will be the 34th home game in the last four years for the Bison, and the final time playing inside the Fargo Dome for 24 seniors. Uh, it's crazy to think, you know, coming in as a freshman, it goes it goes by pretty fast. And uh, but you know, we're gonna definitely make our last game in the dome worth it. I can tell you that. To know that this is gonna be my final time playing on this field, uh, playing in front of this crowd at home, uh, it's gonna be a big day for me. North Dakota State and New Hampshire square off with a trip to Frisco, Texas, on the line. Kickoff is set for 7 p.m. Friday on ESPN2 from Gate City Bank Field. You know, before you always said, okay, there's another game, there's another game, there's another game. Uh, but you say, hey, this is it.